Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalisa and this is Homemade Sunshine. So I have a little thrift haul for you guys today, but this is a little bit different than normal. So these are all things that I'll be showing you that my mom has picked up for me recently. This is gonna be I'm showing a small haul now and then I'll have another haul of things that she's bringing me because she's coming to visit us next, well actually just in a couple of days, she'll be here all next week. So we like to thrift for each other and shop for each other when there's really good deals. Um, we kind of have gone back and forth. Like I used to be able to find her more stuff when we lived in Virginia because we had some really, really good thrift stores up there. And now I don't live in a place that has as good of thrifting. We have good yard sales, but you know, it's a little hit or miss with yard sales sometimes. So I'll show you guys the things that she got me. So most of this is thrifted. A few of them are items from Dillard's Outlet. She lives closer to a Dillard's Outlet and they had a sale where a bunch of stuff was only like $3, I think. So very, very exciting. It's wonderful to get new and tag stuff for only three bucks. So let's get started. Let me show you some of the stuff. So first off, are, these are from Dil the Dillard's Outlet. These are Wild Fox joggers. They were originally $92 and they were on sale for, I believe three. Um, I'll put a correction up here if they weren't $3. I'll ask her later but they are so cute. They're very soft. I love their peach and they have this gorgeous like stripes down the side. Now I will say these are very sheer. Uh, you'd have to wear a nude panty underneath, but I'm just going to wear them as loungewear around my house. I don't really wear joggers like out in public. So these are super cute. These are an extra small, I think. Let me check. No, these are a small. I could fit into the extra small, but you know, if you're gonna wear them as relaxing lounge pants, I feel like it's nicer to have a little bit, you know, more looseness, more flowy. So these are very, very pretty and just super soft. I cannot imagine paying $92 for them though. But I can see why they maybe didn't sell in the store because they are pretty sheer. And then this is an eye relax top. I really like that brand from Dillard's. I don't know if they sell it other places, but they just make really comfortable loungewear. This was originally $44 and it was part of that sale. So it's this cute, kind of like slub t-shirt. It's very thick and very warm. So I'll probably wear this more in the winter, but I love these blue stripes. She has it too and she's worn it a lot and she really likes hers. And then next are these super cute. This is the brand PJ Salvage, another brand that I really like. And these were originally $50. They are a size, oh, I'll tell you about the Irelax one. The Irelax was a small. I don't think they make an extra small in that brand. And these are also a small. So they're super cute. Um, I feel like very trendy with the tie-dye. I'm not normally a big tie-dye girl, but I really like this blue tie-dye. So this is another cute pair of lounge joggers. Just, you know, it's nice to have different options for sleepwear. As you can see, there's a lot of sleepwear, loungewear at this sale. And then I think there's oh, one more pair of the pajama pants. These are Sleep Scents, which were originally 36 that she got on sale. They're just really pretty. Uh, they're like a nice fleecy material, but they're this like navy blue background with this gorgeous little floral. I think these are so cute. This is perfect for that like early spring weather when it's still like, you're really sick of wearing like winter colors, but it's still freezing cold. So these are super cute, super fun to match up with some other stuff. And then next are these Free People leggings. Now these are su super, super cute. They're, um, oh, I can't tell you. Y'all, I am so bad about telling you sizes of stuff. These sleep sense pants are a small. Once again, I don't like to wear extra smalls in sleepwear much because I feel like it's just too, like, I want things to be loose while I'm sleeping. So, these are some Free People leggings. They were originally $98 and they were three. That's insane. I cannot imagine paying $98 for leggings, but you know, I'm also cheap, so. There are these gorgeous navy blue and these um, lines that are on them are like reflective. So if you were like jogging or biking or something, um, you know, you'd reflect car lights and they've got this cute ruching on the ankles and then the back has this cute zipper and then that cute little design detail back there. So I got these in an extra small. The brand, it's Free People Movement specifically. So very excited. I love navy. I don't like to wear black colors as much. I don't like black and I don't like gray. So I love when I can find navy as a neutral. I say I don't like navy or I don't like gray, but here I am. This is the same pair of leggings and an extra small, same sale, same deal. Um, just 
this one, the color is gray. I don't mind gray for like workout stuff because well, most workout stuff is gray. So that doesn't really bug me. I just don't like to wear like gray t-shirts as much or gray uh, pants. I don't mind gray if it's in with other stuff. Like if it's a graphic tee that's like really like got a lot of stuff going on, but the background's gray, that doesn't really bother me. I always just associate gray with boring where I'm like, I want colors and crazy and like lots of different stuff going on. Okay, and then one more item I think from the Dillard's outlet. This is super cute. This is, what is the brand of this? It was originally $32. This is Walk Hole, which is nice. It's a cooling tank. So it's racerback and it's nude. So you'd use this for layering and it just looks, it's really soft. And like, even just to touch the fabric, it's nice and nice and cool to your touch, to your skin. So very excited to try this out. This is a size small, I believe. Yes. It's a size small, and that nude is very close to my skin color, thankfully. Sometimes nude is too dark for me. Okay, so here's some of the thrifted items that she picked up for me. So this is super pretty. I believe this was $2.50 when she picked this up. This is a gorgeous loft dress. I love that high neckline, and that's that little bit of a sleeve. And I love dresses that, I don't know what this is called, where it gathers in at the waist just on the one side, but it's really pretty. It's lined. I feel like this is just like the perfect, like, really nice dress for fall, like for Thanksgiving or another sort of event like that. I think this will be super cute. And then next are these really pretty Talbot knit pants. Oh, I don't think I told you the size of this dress. Y'all, I am so scatterbrained today. I was relaxing on my hammock and then decided to film this. So I'm just like all relaxed. So the last dress was a size small. These Talbot's pants are a size two. They're just super pretty knit, really like high quality pants. I think these will be really pretty for winter or like late fall or early spring, any of those times. <laughs> but they're very pretty. It's just a nice straight leg. I think these would be really pretty with like a nice dressed up blouse. Yeah, when you're feeling fancy. I have a pair of knit pants like these. Um, no, I think they're from Gap. And I like those because they're high waisted and they flare. So I feel like this is like, their cousin, this is their pants cousin, for the tops that don't look good with flares. You know when you wanna wear a big blousy shirt? I don't like to wear a big blousy shirt also with flared pants, so. These are also for winter, so I have to say if you're not a big thrifter, you gotta thrift off season. Because if you're like new to thrifting and you're like, oh, I want some stuff for the summer. Well, it's kinda too late to find summer stuff. You'll find it every once in a while. Like yard sales, I mean, people are pulling out stuff they've gathered all year, so that's not really the same, but like thrift stores, you'll find the better stuff off season. So these are Loft Outlet High Rise Skinnies, the little tags. So these are size four, which I never take a four. So these are, but I feel like in cords, they're really small. Like look how tiny that waist is. It's really teeny. I mean, yeah, it's small. But they're this gorgeous lavender color. I absolutely love these. I once thrifted a pair from Loft of like this same color cords, but they were a double zero and they didn't fit, so I had to sell them. Um, the thrift store I used to go to in Virginia, you could try clothes on, but then when COVID hit, you couldn't try anything on anymore, so you were just like guessing your sizes and hoping things fit, so I had to just resell those and get my money back out of them. Now these are really cute. These are J. Crew Outlet High Rise Vintage Straight Leg Jeans. These are a size 26, so I think that's like a two. I love this button fly. This is so cute and they're actually really high rise. So I'm very like long torso. So for things that are like high rise look usually more like mid rise on me anyways. I can't wear low rise at all. I feel like it's just like, it's just not a good look for me. Um, and they've got these cute pockets and they're like a cropped length. So very, very cute. At first I wasn't sure if they were supposed to be cropped or not, but then I, um, if you're ever looking, if you want to see like what the models look like in a J.Crew item, they do put style numbers in J.Crew items. Here, I'll try to show you here. If you can see that, Ooh, maybe, kind of. But it's underneath these big tags, unless somebody has cut it out. Sometimes it's nice um, when you're like thrifting something blind to be able to like look it up and see like what is it supposed to look like on the person. Or if you can't really tell if it's like, a straight leg or a boot cut or if it's a boot cut or a flare then you can kind of look up the style number and then it'll usually I say like nine times out of ten will populate with like 
somebody who's got it listed on Poshmark or eBay with a stock photo and then it'll say like, you know, high rise vintage straight crop jeans. And you're like, okay, so they are cropped and they are skinny. So good tip for you there. And last but not least, oh, no, I didn't tell you how much these would have been. I think these all would have been um, $2.50. Um, actually, I know, well, yep, $2.50, these were $2.00, and the blue pants were also $2.50, so three items for $2.50, one for two. And then last, this would have been $2.50 also. This is a gorgeous, I love the brand Mac Studio. I like their skirts and their dresses. I don't really like their tops, um, but they make a few dress styles I really like. So this is this gorgeous red with this beautiful pattern on the underarms underneath, maxi dress. So it is very pretty. It does have side slits, but they don't come past the knee. They come like to the knee. So they're not like, you know, sometimes you'll pick up a maxi dress and then slit like all the way like up to your hips and you're like, what the heck is this? What am I supposed to wear with this? So this is just super duper pretty. I really love the design. It's almost, you could wear it patriotic. Like you could wear this if you were doing, I don't know what y'all do for 4th of July. Um, comment down below if you have anything interesting going on for 4th of July, I'd love to hear it. You know, uh, if you have maybe something more formal planned, maybe you have, you know, I don't know, maybe you do something formal for 4th of July. I don't know anybody who does that, but maybe you do. And this would be a good dress for that. You know, you just never know. So that is my haul for today. And I will be filming what she brings me this time, if any of it fits. All of these things fit. I will usually like trade back and forth and I'll send her back the things that don't fit. So I will hop back in here when she brings me those other stuff and I'll show you what she found for me in her neck of the woods. I will talk to you guys then. Bye. Hey y'all, so I'm coming back with part two of my haul of things my mom has thrifted for me recently. Some of it's from yard sales, thrift stores, and a consignment store had a 90% off sale actually the one that we go to all the time, but they just did 90% off of long sleeves and I think one other category, but I can't remember what that one is right now. But let's get started. Let me show you some cute stuff. Um, it's really hard to thrift for another person um, if you've never done it before, but my mom and I have been thrifting and shopping for each other for so long that it's just, I feel like second nature to us at this point. We've like really, we pretty much have nailed down each other's clothing preferences. So, it's not too hard. Every once in a while we'll pick up something that the other person doesn't like, but first are these Old Navy chambray shorts. I really like these because the inseam is really long. I don't like to wear anything that's shorter than basically three inches or shorter. It has to be like at least four or five inches. These are a size two and these were 50 cents at a thrift store that she goes to. I have no idea why they were 50 cents because to me they're in like perfect condition and these if you've ever had Old Navy chambray shorts, they usually get like really worn in the crotch after a while. So these are perfectly fine. I don't know why they, you know, put them for 50 cents, but I'm happy they did. <laughs> and then next, this is from the, one of the 90% off sales that she went to. So this would have been, let's look at the tag, 80 cents, <laughs> which is crazy. So this is just cropped and borrow. It's a size small. Just a cute little open front cardigan. It's this really pretty blue, marled color, like a light blue, a white, and a navy, which this will be really cute layered with some blouses in the fall. But I also like to wear cardigans around my house sometimes because especially when it's the big juxtaposition of like, it's super hot outside and then you come inside and you're freezing. So we're kind of in that weather right now. Next is this other really pretty, this is the brand Lou and Gray. I love Lou and Gray stuff. But I don't find it thrifting that often. I don't know why. I really like their stuff, but I rarely find it. But this is a size small. This was $1.40. And it's this really pretty, I always find it hard to show these kind of cardigans. It's got these really pretty stripes and they both have front pockets. So Blue and Gray is Loft's loungewear brand, um, which I'll probably still wear this out. I mean, you can wear their loungewear out, but it's just very cute. It's very soft. The fabric is really nice. I feel like Lou and Gray always uses really nice fabrics with their loungewear. So that is super cute. Next is a skirt. This was a quarter at a yard sale. She went to a yard sale where everything for the most part was a quarter. Um, this is an older Ann Taylor Loft size zero side zip skirt. If I, I'm 24 and this is exactly what I used to wear a lot of, but of course they were shorter because they were all from like hauls during Abercrombie back in the day. But this was like 
totally the style of skirt I would wear in middle school. So to me, this is like, this is like middle school Annalisa all grown up with all these little ruffles. I really like this gray. So I'm very much someone that wears colors for the season that I'm in. So once we get into fall here, it's usually still pretty hot, but I don't wanna wear sailboats anymore. So this is the kind of thing that I will be wearing like come September, October when it's still really hot and I wanna have, you know, not summer colors on anymore. And then this skirt was also a quarter. This was Ann Taylor. Another little side zip skirt is this pretty blue medallion pattern. I like how long it is. I'm very, I would say probably the pickiest thing I am about clothing is like my skirt lengths. I don't like my skirts to be too short. I want to be able to like move around in my daily life and not have to worry about a skirt being too short. So I'm very particular about those. And this is a great length. I, I really am most comfortable with things that are like right above the knee or longer. I don't really like to wear anything too short. So next, this was also a quarter from that same yard sale. This is a pair of Gap Fit extra small leggings from the outlet, apparently. And they just have this really small, like striped pattern to them. I will probably just wear these as lounge leggings for, you know, my Sunday lounge wear in the winter. It's nice to have leggings that aren't like super tight to just like lounge around the house in with a sweatshirt come winter time. So that's what these will be for. And then this is a pair of Nike extra, is it extra small or small? Let's see extra small, light gray leggings. Also really nice for lounging come this winter, also a quarter. They're just very plain, but I like having new loungewear leggings because they always end up getting, you know, super messed up. Now this was, I think 50 cents. Uh, my mom and I both got one. It's a little underwear sack. I don't know, we haven't decided how we're gonna use them yet, but the embroidery is just stunning and they were never used. It was in a cellophane packaging, but they have never used it. And it's so pretty, it's so pretty. Um, I said, I wish I could just frame it, which maybe I will try to do that. Like just uh, get it to where you could frame it and like hang it in a um, laundry room. That'd be very cute. All right, so here's some long sleeve shirts. So the majority of what she favored for me was not stuff that's in season, which of course is another big like key thing is Usually when you go thrifting, you're gonna find stuff out of season. But then when you put it away and pull it out for fall, it's like, oh, I have a, so most of my off season clothing is stored in the attic, which I don't really wanna have to get into the attic constantly. It's not super easy. So I keep a tub, like a long tub under my bed that's empty. And I put all, so like if it's summer, I put all my fall winter clothes in there that I thrift for the next season. So when it gets to be that time, I just pull them out from under the bed and voila, there's all my new clothes ready for the new season. So this is a Lucky Brand size small. The price of this would have been $1.40. And I love this color, that blue with this white embroidery. I don't wear a ton of Lucky Brand. It's a little bit too boho most of the time for me, but a few of their pieces I really like. And this is super cute. I think it'd be really pretty for spring or as we go into fall. I'm talking about fall and it's only June. I love summer, it's my favorite season, but I thrift off season sometimes. So this next Simply Southern shirt was $1.50 and look at that, brand hammer new. I really like Simply Southern. I don't have a ton. I don't ever buy it like full price in the store. So this is the front, just this pretty gray and look how cute. It says best friends come in all shapes and sizes and it's just dogs. I love it. It's so pretty. And I feel like I don't like to wear a lot of gray, but the gray for this really makes all the other colors in the shirt pop really well. And I like that it's pink. And of course, most of these long sleeve shirts is simply Southern down the side. So very, very cute. Love, love, love that. Love a good graphic tee. As you can see, I'm wearing a Vera Bradley Smoky Mountains t-shirt today. So love a good graphic tee. Next is this White House Black Market blouse. It was $1.60. And it's a size small. It's this really pretty maroon color. I love this and it's really thin for fall. It has these little ties that come like right above your elbow. They stay tied pretty well. And it's just the perfect, I love this shade for fall. I don't like this color year round, but come fall, I'll be really excited to wear that. Next is this Talbot's size small t-shirt. It was 15, so $1.50. And it's just a really pretty navy blue. It looks like the neckline's really big, but it's not like 
super cleavage bearing. It more like goes across like almost like a boat neck, but it's very pretty. Shows off a lot your shows off a lot of your collarbone. It's very pretty. And I love navy. Navy is my favorite of the neutral colors. So very excited to have that in my wardrobe. Maybe with this fall, I'll be able to pair it with some of these skirts and you know, dress them up. Now this is a Talbot's medium. My mom thrifted this for herself and somebody shrunk it because it's 97% cotton or no, 100% cotton. So somebody shrunk this and it's no longer actually fits like a medium. So this was $1.50, but I love this color. And if you can see the texture on there is just super pretty, three quarter length sleeve. I love this shade of like a sky blue is very cute. So this will be perfect come springtime next year. I don't know, I just, I have a couple scars that I can just imagine. It's gonna look so, so pretty come that time. I have one sweater, this is a loft extra small. This was from that 25 cent yard sale. And it's this beautiful emerald green. It's three quarter sleeves, but it's plain on the front, but the back is all buttons, which they don't gape. I was worried they would gape, but they don't gape open, so. Because this is really like fitted, you're not supposed to wear like a camisole underneath. I mean, I guess you could, but it's too fitted for me to wear a camisole underneath, but. Super pretty, love the button details. They're very cute. And then last, but certainly not least, is a J Jill Extra Small. J Jill is really hit or miss for me. This was also a quarter, which if you know how expensive J Jill is, that's a deal. That's a steal, so this will be perfect for fall or spring. It's this long peach colored tunic. And it it's one of those shirts where like off the hanger, you can't, on the hanger, off the hanger, not on your body, you can't really tell if it's gonna look super cute or not, but this is actually just like really, really pretty. So that is my big haul. Thank you to my mom who will be watching this um, for my big haul. It is just so nice to have somebody else thrift for you. It's like getting Christmas all year long and it's so fun when we get to trade with each other and we have what we call a try on party and we both try on all the things that we've gotten for each other and it's just really fun and it's nice because sometimes if you're just, if you're only shopping for yourself, sometimes it can be hard, you know, you might have just a bad day where you don't find anything for yourself, but when you're shopping for two people, one day you might find a lot for one person and the next day you might find a lot for yourself. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know who all you're shopping for and just leave me a comment down below. I shop in total for my mom, dad, my brother, and my husband, and then myself. So I shop for five, but Drop me a number down below and let me know how many people you're shopping for. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.